Hey everyone, welcome to this first video of the QGIS tutorial series. Before we can dive into maps, layers, and all the fun stuff, we need to get QGIS installed on your computer. Don't worry, this part's quick and easy. QGIS is open source, which means it's completely free and gets updated regularly by a huge community of developers and users. All right, let's get it installed. First, head over to QGIS.org. Once you're on the homepage, click on the Download Now button. You'll see a few options here depending on your operating system. I'm using Windows, so I'll walk you through that version. But if you're on Mac OS or Linux, the steps are similar. On Windows, I recommend going with the long-term release, also called LTR. It's the most stable version, especially if you're just starting out. Click on the QGIS standalone installer for the LTR version. It should say something like QGIS 3.xx LTR, so it might take a minute depending on your internet speed. Once the download finishes, open the installer and follow the setup steps. You can pretty much leave everything on the default settings. Just keep clicking Next until it starts installing. The whole installation process usually takes two to five minutes. Once it's done, you'll see a QGIS icon on your desktop. Go ahead and launch it. It might take a few seconds to load up the first time. If everything went well, you should see the QGIS interface with a blank project and toolbars at the top. Congrats, you're in. That's it for the installation. Thanks for watching and let's keep going.